This is a reading I never thought I'd have to do. Um, we're going to do a reading on Free Britney. Hashtag Free Britney. So as most of you know, I am a huge Britney Spears stan. And this is going to be the hardest reading I've ever had to do in my life. Because I've never loved someone more than I love Britney Spears. And I never will. Uh, she is my everything. And I want to handle this reading with sensitivity and care. I want to handle this reading as best I can, but also it's something that I have to do. Um, I've been toying with doing this reading for a long time now, uh, since they announced the cancellation of Domination, and I just didn't know how to do it or if I could, but I have no choice, uh, so I'm just going to do it. So we're basically going to see what's going on with Brittany. Um, we're basically going to see... Uh, why did she cancel the tour? What's going on with her and her her dad? Uh, you know, is she actually in the mental health facility against her will? We're going to be looking at all this stuff. So I'm going to try my best not to get emotional. Um, but I am very invested in this reading. So let's just go ahead and get it over with. God damn it. Well, there's Brittany. Uh-oh. All right, uh, the Nine of Cups is about not getting what we want. So she wasn't giving them what they wanted, that's for sure. And the Queen of Wands is upright with the Death card, so this is Domination. Domination was forcibly canceled on her. I'm 100% certain about this. If Death was reversed, it would have been inevitable. When it's upright, it means it was purposely canceled, and the Queen of Wands is upright, which means that she was actually passionate about it and actually wanted to do it. The King of Swords is reversed here, which means that it was someone else. Um, and the King of Wands is reversed with Two of Swords, which means two men worked side by side. Either a uh, fire and an, and an air sign, or just two men in general. It doesn't really matter. But the Two of Swords is reversed, which means that they made this, this decision for her. So this would probably... If I'm going to be honest with you, this sounds like her manager, and this sounds like her dad. Because uh, they're two male figures that made the decision for her. That is 100% clear emotionally she is not in the place that they're saying that she's in so she, obviously we know Brittany's a little bit fragile emotionally but she's not completely vulnerable to the point where she can't handle her emotions that's bullshit uh the queen of cups is upright in fact i actually think that she was doing better on her own the fool's reverse which means that she was being mature and she wasn't being naive she wanted more responsibility she wanted to take more uh time for herself she wanted to do things on her own terms and the ten of wands reverse which means she wanted less of a burden uh in terms of permissions uh she wanted freedom i mean that's why the fool's reversed um she definitely feels trapped we're aware of that um the seven of wands is upright which means she actually was proving herself uh but unfortunately the knight of swords reversed with the world upright which means somebody here got in the way Hmm. This is unfinished business, so it's something that's been going on for a while. And then the Knight of Swords. Oh my god. Is that Sam? Oh. F f that's Sam. Uh oh. Guys, I think Sam snitched on her. Sam Ascari snitched on her. Because this is about job, and then the Three of Wands outside of career. And then the moon is reversed, which is about telling a secret. Sam snitched on her. She was doing something that was quote-unquote against the rules, and Sam snitched on her. 100% certain that Sam Ascari snitched on her. I don't know if it was malicious or if it was accidental, because I do see some sort of guilt. Because a judgment card is upright. It usually means that, like, it usually means they had pure intentions. But it was a little bit of a sensitive spot. And it definitely caused a catalyst. So I actually think, I think he accidentally told on her about something she was doing. Now, the, the interesting thing here is I actually didn't pull money. So um, I'm going to be very blunt with you guys. Um, I know there's a lot of accusations about them trying to use Britney for money. I don't think that this is about money. I haven't pulled pentacles at all. I don't think this is about money. Um, the Three of Cups is about trust. 
The Six of Wands is about ego and pride, and the Two of Cups is reversed, which is about, I'm going to be honest, it's about, it's about the interpersonal connection, so it's control. Um, lovers is reversed to the magician and the ten of swords, which means that they feel like she will pick some. They legitimately believe that Brittany will leave this conservatorship, okay? And when she leaves it, she'll pick someone and she'll f ruin everything. They feel like she'll trust the wrong person and ruin everything. They actually believe this. But the reasons they believe it is not because they're worried about Brittany. The reason they believe this is because they want control. They want to be able to make sure that she does what they want them to than they want her to do rather than what she wants to do because they feel like it's gotten to the point now where they feel like Brittany Brittany's rebellion is her personality they're 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 one and the same they feel like that's Brittany's personality and they feel like if they let her be that way she'll destroy everything they actually think that and for them it's more about an embarrassment in terms of they failed rather than wanting her to live her life so that's why it's control um, Brittany has spoken to us and will speak to us again. So the Queen of Swords is a verse, which is uh, her being alienated or pushed aside. The Page of Wands. So this means that they're not letting her speak. However, when the Four of Wands is a verse, obviously she's been pulled out of her environment on purpose uh, and against her will. I definitely think that. Um, but the issue here is she's spoken to us through someone so she's definitely there's either been a sly dig there's been you know an inverted post or something she spoke through someone and she's going to do it again she will be talking to us inadvertently through someone else it's through another person uh or through i don't know if it's a message or what it's it's sly though you, you're gonna have to read between the lines here that's mom that's the internet and that's reliability okay i don't know if it's going to be lynn uh, but I did pull mom here reverse, which tells me that uh, Lynn knows more than she's let on. Um, and I will also tell you that it seems like Lynn is doing more than we realize. I think uh, Lynn is doing more than we realize. Lynn seems to be going to bat for her because the Ace of Pentacles reverse, which means she's not looking for that. She's looking for the family. Um, so Lynn seems to be going to bat for her. Um, there's not a crazy conspiracy. I wish there was. That would have made this easier. But it's pride and ego. Yeah, we're overthinking it. It has nothing to do with money. You guys, it has nothing to do with money. I'm telling you, it has nothing to do with money. It has nothing to do with money, and I really think that Lynn is our ticket in to Britney's life. Because this is about having patience, so... The Free Britney mo movement needs to be consistent, um, so don't give up. We are going to see a slow change. They are going to give her more freedom when she gets out because of the pressure. Mm. Oh my God, they sabotaged her album. So this would be job, right? But this is control. And this is fighting and the Queen of Pentacles. They sabotage, sabotage an album. They 100% sabotage an album, and it's uh, it was uh, one of Britney's creative babies. This is an album that was sabotaged that would have been absolutely amazing, and they completely sabotaged this, and we might actually hear something from this. This might leak. This might leak. We might hear something from this. This might leak. This is If this leaks, if a song leaks, this is Britney. If this leaks, it's from Britney. Britney made sure this leaked. I'm telling you there's a song or an album or something is going to leak and it's from Britney. I know the Make Me video leaked, so I'm wondering if Britney did that. But th whatever the case may be, remember I said she talked to us once? Something else is going to leak, but it's from Britney directly and it's going to be on purpose. She's purposely going to leak something to piss them off. It's a direct message. Remember when she made that song? Um, uh, uh, be weary of others, the ones closest to you. Dun, 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 dun. The poison they feed you and the voodoo that they do. Rebellion. It's like rebellion. We're literally going to get something where it's like an indirect. Yeah, I'm telling you, there's the star. Okay. Um, all right. Good news is I don't see any issues with the kids. Other good news is I don't see any issues with Kevin. Um, I do think Sam accidentally did something. He doesn't strike me as like completely malicious. I think he accidentally said something. Um, the other good news is this has nothing to do with money. Anyone who tells you this has anything to do with money is delusional. 
Um, they're not utilizing her as a cash cow. It's ego, pride, and control. Um, and like I said before, they think that, that Brittany legitimately will ruin everything. They actually truly believe that she's incapable because they feel like Brittany's rebellion and rebelliousness is just her new personality. Um, <laughs> oh my god. All right, she is definitely going to be freed. So the conservatorship will be ending soon. Uh, it's going to take a little bit. They'll give her a little bit more freedom, and then I see the conservatorship ending. Um, so this is about hiding your true self, uh, which means that someone close to her is 1,000% going to lose everything close to them. Um, the Guild of Regret card says that they feel bad uh, for what they've done. Um, it's become an obsession, obviously, and the triumph of lies about her winning here. So I actually think that there's one person here uh, who's kind of just gotten too invested, and they're going to lose everything from this uh not just like their career everything their personal life everything is going to uh, turn to shit the calling of the storm sh card means that this person's entire life is going to be uprooted um and, and they'll be exposed for everything that they've ever done um the artificial heart says that they're robotic cold and don't really give a shit uh like i said before this is our main culprit uh, this is definitely our main culprit that has done this yeah there's the naked before the stars card this is this is like a britney card okay this would be our performer then we pulled the Is This Me card. Wait, one more. Hmm. Interesting. I'm trying to figure out who this is. You know, I know Brittany, so I'm trying to figure out who this is. They have they they have a severe lack of empathy and sympathy. I won't cry for you. Perchance to dream and is this me? This person has not been forced to look into the mirror. They're jaded. So it has to be someone that's been around her for a while. I'm going to reshuffle to see if I can pull more on this person because I want to know who this person is. I want to find out if it's a male or female. Because this person is jaded as fuck. Like completely 100% jaded. Massively jaded to the point where I don't even think they're living in the real world anymore. They're in this bubble. So let's see if we can figure out who this is, because this person's life is pretty much going to be ruined based off of what they've been doing. <clears throat> see if we can figure out who this is, guys. is reverse it's a female queens and an empress it's a female that had problems with Lynn this female I pulled every freaking queen in the deck it's a female that had direct problems with Lynn Lynn has had a direct public problem with this person and I'm going to be honest with you I don't know who that is I do not follow Lynn like that so I don't know maybe someone in the comments will know uh, but I do not know who that is. It's a direct, it's a female who's had a direct problem with Lynn, who is the one that's kind of, I wouldn't say they're the ringleader, but they're the one that's kind of spinning everything. Oh my God, this is, this is exactly, this is the same exact spread that I just did. You guys saw me shuffle, right? King of Swords, King of Wands, and the Two of Swords. This is Mimics the last reading, identical. So she's the one that's kind of been putting the bug in these two people's ears. This would be her dad and her manager. It's a female. She has an inappropriate connection with one of those guys, by the way. A very inappropriate connection. It's a very inappropriate connection. Like, mixing business with pleasure. <laughs> yeah, girl, the moon's upright, secrets. Uh, she has a little bit of an extra reason to be involved here and she is so there's someone who's the go between between Brittany there's someone there's a female standing between Brittany and her dad and manager and that girl is our problem that chick is our problem 
That's our problem. She's right in the middle between them, and she's the problem, and she has an inappropriate relationship with one of those two people. I don't know if it's her dad or her manager, but she got an inappropriate connection with one of them, and she is our problem. She's the one that's going to lose everything. I honestly think that if we remove her, everything should set back into motion. Because Brittany does, we know that Brittany does have problems uh, with her mental health. We're aware of that. But somebody here is fanning flames. And it's not, It's. I'm telling you guys, it's not money. It has nothing to do with money. They have more than enough money. They all have more than enough money. They don't want more money. Okay? They also are not looking for power. It's control. It's control and ego. That's what it is. Control, ego, and pride. Because they've saved her once before, so they can't lose her. That's what it is. And control is like, well, you say what I say. We do what I say. Which I think that's her dad. I think her dad is the, is, is the control, and I think her, her manager is the, is the ego. <clears throat> well, I made it through this reading without crying. So that's good. Wow. You actually, you know how she's going to get out of this? So um, she's obviously trapped. So that's a conservatorship. Remember I said it, there's going to be a way to get this to be ending, to be over? She's going <laughs> to... I actually think she's going to be able to pay her way out of the conservatorship. I think if she gives everyone a settlement and tells them to fuck off, I think they might strike a deal with her. I think after the dust settles and they give her more freedom, I actually think if she writes a big enough check, I think they'll leave her alone. Yeah, this is her freedom, the fool. Also, by the way, if you're a... Uh, if you're looking for new music, this is going to be the best thing to ever happen to us because Britney is about to literally give us the album of a lifetime once she's freed. Once she's freed, we're going to get the album of a lifetime. And let me tell you something. It's going to do big numbers. It's going to do big, 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 big numbers. She's already sitting on 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 on, on a song, by the way. She's already sitting on a song, so I wouldn't be surprised if she's writing uh, right now. She's sitting on a song. She's 100% sitting on a song right this moment. If we can get them to let go of her, she'll be able to release it. Um, and it's going to be the biggest thing ever. So, fingers crossed. Now, I'm not super worried about like detriment to career because, in fact, I think it's opposite. I think they're thinking, wow, look at all this publicity. This will be great for her career. So that's kind of a good thing for us because they won't do anything stupid. Um, I'm not really worried about... Uh, her emotional health either i think she's in a really good place um i do think she was put in there against her will um but i don't think it was as like scary or malicious as it's being said i think it was more along the lines of britney did something she shouldn't have done she wasn't doing what she was supposed to do so i think sam accidentally told on her um, and then I think they basically were like, well, if you're not going to do this, we're going to make you do this, which makes sense, right? And that somehow led to her being in a facility. Um, so I guess technically it's, it's obviously clearly morally corrupt, but it's not necessarily malicious, if that makes sense. You have to understand something. This is what you have to understand. These people are jaded and they don't, they no longer have a heart. Britney Spears is no longer a person to them. She's an object. And so it's hard to say that, they, that, they, that they're that they being malicious when they've just become jaded. You know, it's not like, you know, I just want to take you know advantage of you and I want all your money. It's like, I've been in it too long. I'm emotionally sort of dead inside because of this. And they're making decisions that are inhuman because of that. that's why I pulled the artificial heart. They're making a decision that's inhuman because of it. And also this chick that's in the middle is causing a problem and she's kind of fluffing up some of the issues. So for instance, if Brittany was sad, she would have said that she was doing something, you know, worse, if you understand what I'm saying. So like, that's why this information, that's what I'm telling you. There's a chick, dude, that's like, that's like, amping up what Britney's experiencing and, and and this person is gonna lose everything because of this. So 
she's probably going to end up causing problems for the other guys too because I don't think they really are aware of what she's doing. Well, I should rephrase that. I think they're aware of what she's doing, but they don't care because they're like, well, it sounds about right. I think it's like one of those things where they're in the back of their mind, they're like, I don't think that's real, but it fits the narrative we want to go for. So... <sighs> This is a frustrating thing. Um, why don't we try one more time to see if we can get a timeline? You know, timing is really difficult, but considering this is my queen, I want to see if I can try to get timing. We'll try. We're going to try. try so she's been in there since January right January February March April Oh, they're going to get her out of there soon. Okay, so she's going to be... So this is four. So it's usually like four months. She should be out of... She should be getting out of the facility soon. Um, I do think it's going to be um, to save face, but that's okay because we can get her out of there. We're going to be able to get her out of the facility soon. But as for the conservatorship, looks like eight months we're going to be here. Eight months should be a very important uh, hearing. This is eight, This is usually eight months. Because this would be about career and opportunity, so she's gonna leverage. She's gonna leverage the song and the album. She's going to leverage her music. She's going to stonewall them. So Britney is going to be pissed. Britney is going to be pissed, and she's not going to do a damn thing unless they let her go. She is not doing a damn thing unless they let her go. And let me tell you something: her mom is gonna go to bat for her. She's not letting she her mom is gonna is go to go to go to bat for her, um, and she is not going to do a damn thing. This she's not lifting a finger unless they remove the the entire conservatorship. She's not lifting a finger. She won't do it. She's going to be extremely rebellious. She will not do anything unless it's removed. We are going to empower Brittany. She's going to hear about what we've been doing. To be honest with you, I wouldn't be surprised if her sister already told her about what we've been doing. Um, that's another thing. Nobody come for Jamie Lynn. She's always had Britney's back. Anyways, um, I think we're going to empower Britney, and I don't think she's going to do a damn thing unless this entire thing is removed. And I also think that she's going to be a little bit feistier than we're used to. You know, Britney is carefree, but uh, I see a fire lit under her ass, and the Ace of Swords is upright, which says she's going to, with the Three of Cups, she's going to use other people as well. She's going to pull other people in to help her. Three of Cups. There are three main women that are going to help her. And to be honest with you, I think these are industry women. I think they're three pop stars. I think these are three pop stars. I think these are three pop stars. That have dealt with similar shit. They've been vulnerable, they've dealt with the same problem, and they've overcome it. There are three pop stars that are going to come. There are three pop stars. <laughs> come through, Debbie and BB Rexa. I'm dead. I don't know about all that. But I see three pop stars. There are three pop stars that are going to be a very important thing, and they're females. Well, this is a hard reading. Um... Yeah, I think she'll end up. I think they'll end up being a settlement to get her out of here. Um, she doesn't care about money, and to be honest with you, neither do they. But money will still talk, so that's good. Um, this is actually not as bad as I was expecting. To be honest with you, it's really not as bad as I was expecting. She's not really in that bad of an emotional place, um, and I do think we're gonna end up saving Brittany. So, oh, <sighs> that was hard. Well, to all my fellow Brittany stands, I love you. Uh, we will be in this together. Um, and we will save mother. Uh, Brittany's always been a big sis in my head. Um, and Brittany was there for me when I had no one. So 
I'm glad that we could be there for her when she has no one. So, um, yeah, definitely looking forward to this emotional breakthrough in terms of her music, though. Guys, she's been trying to release some really good shit for so long, and they won't let her. They won't let her. Maybe she's gonna do. She's gonna have a mouth now. I'm telling you, she's gonna have. She's gonna have mouthpieces. She's gonna be talking through other people. So pay attention to everyone she connects with or has connected with. Anything you think. What is that? It's from Britney directly. It's not from her camp. It's from Britney directly. Britney is getting messages in a bottle to us. Pay attention. Hope you enjoyed that. Uh, if you did, uh, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch, Amphrodite. Uh, go to Amphrodite.com for your own personal readings. Uh, if you have suggestions for readings you want me to do, put them in the comments below. Um, and if you're a Britney fan, I love you. Thanks so much.